Hello. Hmm. Huh? Look. Oh. Huh? Oh. Hmm. What? <laughs> huh? Look. Oh. I'm Sally. And I'm Possum. Hello. Hello everyone, I've just made a pie and I've put it in the oven to bake. I know that Possum is going to smell it baking and he will come straight in. You watch. <laughs> oh, hello everyone. Oh, I can smell something. It's delicious. Sally must be cooking something. Oh, let's have a look. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Here he is. <laughs> oh, hello, possum. Oh, that smells delicious. Can I eat it? Is it ready? No, you'll have to wait half an hour for it to bake. So give it 30 minutes and it will be ready. Sally, half an hour is not long, but why do I have to wait 30 minutes? That's too long. They're actually the same amount of time, Possum. When you're looking at a clock and the big hand goes all the way around, that's one hour, 60 minutes. For half an hour, it means the big hand only goes halfway round the clock. Half of 60 minutes is 30 minutes, and that's half an hour. Can you check the clock? OK. Um, hmm. Sally, I'd love to learn more about time, but the clock's not there. What? Oh, oh, I'm so sorry, Possum. I completely forgot. The clock had something wrong with it and it stopped working. So I gave it to Skip to see if he could fix it. Oh, OK. Oh, OK. Skip's very clever at fixing things. He's great. Have we been talking for half an hour yet? Oh, no, 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 Possum. It's only been a minute. Just one little minute. You need to wait for 30 of them before the pie will be ready. Oh, OK. I'm going to need that clock so I can look at it to know when the pie is ready. I'd better go see Skip and check to see if he's fixed the clock yet, OK? Oh, yes, great idea, Possum. While you're there, can you ask him if he'd like to come over and eat some pie later? Yep, OK. Bye. Bye. <laughs> no. <laughs> huh? Ahoy there, Possum! Hello, Skip! Come on in. How are you? Good. Skip, have you finished fixing Sally's clock? Yes, I've finished, and it is working. Sally had put in a new battery, but it wasn't working. I did a bit of investigating and found out that the contacts were dirty. So, I cleaned them up, and now the clock is ticking! Oh, good. I need this clock because Sally is cooking a pie and she said I had to wait 30 minutes. Have you and I been chatting for 30 minutes? Half an hour? Oh, no. We've only been chatting for half a minute. Oh, half a minute? How long is that? 30 seconds. Seconds? What's that? 
Hmm. Has Sally talked to you about time? Oh, yes. Well, one hour is 60 minutes, half an hour is 30 minutes, and the pie is cooked for 30 minutes or half an hour. Very good. Well, a minute has got 60 seconds in it. Oh. Actually, seconds are lots of fun to watch. Some clocks have a second hand and some don't. See? Look at the orange hand here. It's going tick, 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 tick. I can see it. Oh, I have an old clock over here that doesn't have a second hand. Come and have a look at this one. <gasps> it's the same as Sally's clock. It's round and it's got hands on it. Yes, it is like Sally's clock, but there are a few things different. Have a look. Do you see that thing swinging back and forth? That's called a pendulum. It swings back and forth, and every time it gets back to the start, a second has gone by. It's interesting. Clocks make noises, but we don't need to hear them, Possum. We can just see them. Oh, so does that mean... One, two, three, four, five? Is that right? Yes, you're right. Oh, that's great. That's interesting. So when you get to 60 back and forths, that means 60 seconds, and that is one minute. And then once the minute hand has turned right round the clock, that's 60 minutes, which is one hour. Oh, I get it. That's great. Skip, watch me. One, two, three, four... <laughs> That's great. Right, well, I'd better go and see if the pie's ready. Do you want to come and eat some? Oh, no, Possum. I'm going to go up to the top of my crow's nest and watch the clouds and look at the birds fly by. But make sure you take the clock back and give it to Sally. Sally might be able to tell you more about time. Right, OK. Oh. Thank you, Skip. Bye. OK, bye. Bye. finished fixing it. It's ready. Great. Thanks for bringing it over. Can I put it up? Oh, yes. Can you do that? Yes. And... Uh, uh, hmm. ah, done. Oh, great. Sally, I learned so much about time. In Skip's shed, he has a very old clock that he showed me. Oh. It's like your clock. Instead of ticking, it's got a pendulum. Ah. Oh, and it goes like this. Watch me. <laughs> One, two, three, four. That's how many seconds have gone by. Oh, yes, you're right, Possum. A pendulum swinging is so much fun to watch, isn't it? Yeah. The pendulum is what makes the hands move in time. Other clocks don't have a pendulum, but they still work. Some of them have got a minute hand, which is the longer hand, and that counts the minutes. And the shorter one is the hour hand, and they go round and round the clock. Yes, that's right. I saw your clock and Skid's clock. The long hand goes all the way around. That's minutes. When it goes all the way around, that's one hour. That's right. And the shorthand is slow. That's the hours. That's right, Possum. Have a look. Oh. 
I've made you a clock. Ah! Oh. The long hand is the minute hand. And the short hand is the hour hand. Oh. And it has the numbers 1 to 12. Ah. Oh. If the minute hand is pointing at the 12, we need to look at what the hour hand is pointing at. OK. It's pointing at 3. So that means it's three o'clock. Ah! Oh. Can you make a time for me? OK. Hmm. That one. Sally, it's four o'clock. Yes. <laughs> Great. That's right. If the minute hand is pointing straight to the top and the hour hand is on the four, that means it's four o'clock. Now, can you make it seven o'clock? Oh, OK. Now. Hmm. Hmm. Done. Yes. Seven o'clock. That's right. Now I'm going to make a time. Hmm. Oh. What time is it now? Hmm. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's nine o'clock. That's right. Another one. Hmm. Oh. So that means nine, ten. Eleven o'clock, Sally. It's eleven o'clock. That's right. One more. Oh. Hmm. Both pointing up. Ah, it's 12 o'clock. Yes, you're right. It is 12 o'clock. Good job. Sally, when's the pie ready? What time? One o'clock. One o'clock. <gasps> it's one o'clock now. It's ready. Yes. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. <sighs> <laughs> Sally, this is my favourite time. Do you know why? Because the pie is ready and I can eat it. <laughs> <laughs> it's still a bit too hot, Possum. We need to let it cool down. While we wait, why don't we watch some children learning about time? Yeah, let's watch. One day. at the three and the big hand is at the twelve, which means three o'clock, four o'clock, nine o'clock, six o'clock, Yeah, that was fantastic. Those kids are just like me, learning so much about time. Now, remember, 
there's 60 minutes in an hour. That's right. And one minute has 60 seconds in it. Yes. And the pie took 30 minutes, or half an hour, to bake. You're right, Possum. And I'm looking at the pie, and I think it's ready. Great! Oh, yay! Well, our time is up. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye! Bye! Yeah. Oh! <gasps> <laughs> Yum! <sighs> <sighs>